Hello and welcome here. Although there has been a lot of criticism about the post-credits dance sequence in She-Hulk Attorney at Law Episode 3, the reason why appears really innocent. Following the airing of the show, some viewers quickly rushed to social media to express their disgust at the incident, saying it demonstrated how far the MCU had descended. On the surface, it seems to be a harmless comedy sequence, but this is the real reason why the dance scene in She-Hulk Episode 3 has drawn so much criticism. Both the A and B stories are included in She-Hulk Episode 3, with the B story focusing on attorneys Dennis Bukowski and Pug as they try to handle a case involving Dennis and a shape-shifting Asgardian light elf. The A story follows Jennifer Walters as she works to have the abomination granted parole. Dennis's case begins when he spends over $175,000 on his new girlfriend, Megan the Stallion, whom he thinks is a professional artist. Unexpectedly, it turns out that Dennis is not truly dating Megan the Stallion, rather, the lady he has lavished enormous sums of money on is the aforementioned shape-shifting elf. Dennis, who has a case against her and employs Pug to help him win the case so he can get his money back, believes he has a case against her. The real Megan the Stallion makes a surprise cameo appearance in the courtroom, capping off the humorous B story. In the post credits sequence, Megan the Stallion and She-Hulk may be seen twerking together, continuing Megan the Stallion's She-Hulk appearance. She-Hulk has received a lot of unjustified internet criticism, with individuals criticizing the CGI in the show, others review bombing it, and even others making misogynistic remarks about the show. A social media flame war erupted over this particular post credits scene as many viewers criticized the dancing routine. Others said that it sexualized the character in a way that wasn't appropriate for the family-friendly Marvel films, while some claimed that it didn't suit the MCU's tone. She Dancing Hulk's sequence shouldn't have garnered such strong reaction, despite the fact that it did on the internet. Although she Hulk twerking with Megan the Stallion may come across as surprising to some, it really fits the character and the show wonderfully. She Hulk has long broken the fourth wall, and her persona is frequently cited as one of Marvel's funniest superheroes. The sensational She Hulk hash 34's cover even mocks the 1991 edition of Vanity Fair, which featured a photograph of Demi Moore on the front of the magazine. The She-Hulk comics have always made pop culture references and aren't afraid to get a bit risque at times. It's not only uncontroversial, She-Hulk dancing with Megan the Stallion is ideal for the role. The scene's incompatibility with the rest of the MCU is the second major critique. The tone of each MCU production varies, though, and She-Hulk has been specifically pitched as a half-hour comedy. Twerking may seem out of place in a more sinister MCU movie like The Defenders, but it is completely appropriate for the tone that She-Hulk has established so far. The dance sequence in She-Hulk Attorney at Law has generated a lot of debate, yet it works for the show. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.